Hey Steve, this is the uh, idea for the system where I'm going to be regulating using a scalar wave to light up the LEDs on the for the solar panels for night charging by using very low power. And here's a look at the circuit, what I'm doing. I'm not using the little plasma ball, I'm actually using the big plasma ball and I got the cord hooked up there for the light, the AC cord. Then I have another cord that comes down here and it goes to the circuitry right there. That's where the circuitry of the unit is. Of course, it's using scalar power, so it's not the same. It turns it into a square wave, actually, and the heat sink here is just used as like a uh, ground antenna. And what it does is it basically lights, causes those lights to light up like that. Of course, I have to regulate it, regulate the circuitry so that uh, it's always at a high intensity instead of having that flash. So basically, I just got to adjust the uh, hertz on it. But that is the purpose of what my experiment is here. Basically, I'm figuring out how to use uh, lighting with this system. It will use the antenna and ground to increase the power, and then I'll have to regulate from there. This is what the uh, square wave type of scalar, and I'm going to adjust it so that you can see what it's actually doing. And see, since this, uh, LEDs are using direct current, what's happening is going through the system. It's making a square wave, and it's almost like a continuous flow. I just got to um, up the frequency so that uh, that light doesn't flash like that. It will just basically be very bright. And I'll be using the system on the, uh, on the solar panel. So that I can use low voltage, low amps, and produce a lot more. So there's a lot going into this. I'm also working on the HVAC system for cooling the system. So there it is. Talk to you later, Steve.